Hello everybody, welcome to today's video. Thanks for joining me. Um, this is another day from West Herb. This is a West Herb collaboration with Boneface in New Zealand. This is their Commonwealth Pale Ale. It was uh, brewed initially for the Jubilee, but it's good now for the King's uh, King's coronation. 4.2% uh, ABV. Yes, couldn't remember. Um, now, I have to admit, I'll pour it as I'm pour it in my new uh, glass actually. I've never felt under as much pressure doing a review before as these Westerham ones now. Um, so because I, I was lucky enough, privileged, I'm going to say privileged enough to go and see Robert at Western Brewery, um, who was very kindly allowed me to sample all the beers, uh, even a special one that's not released yet. Um, and just to hear him talk with passion about his beers and how they came about and what's in them and why certain hops and, and malts are in his beers. And when you talk to a brewer that's absolutely passionate about his beers, they've just been on a completely different life. Completely different life. So I hope you get some of the stories uh, right, Robert. Um, and I hope I do your beers and uh, Western Brewery uh, proud. So here we are. This is the Commonwealth Pale Ale. It's got um, five malts in it, including Best Ale Malt, uh, caramel, caramel for sweetness, a little bit of toffee flavour. Um, it's got Light Munich in there as well, which gives it a little bit of earthiness, a little bit of spiciness. Tell you what, Robert knows his stuff when it comes to his hops and his malts. He's, he's absolutely fantastic. And to be fair, his place is the first time I've ever tried um, eating whole grain malts. Brilliant. So, a bit of the glass. He has poured a good crystal clear amber colour, yeah, fairly clear amber colour, yeah, with very, very light carbonation. That is a lovely, lovely slow moving carbonation. It looks good. Let's get the aroma, shall we? It's tropical. It's quite mild. I get a bit of um, bit of pineapple, bit of grapefruit. Bit of mango. Yeah, just the back end, a little bit of citrus coming through. Smells a little bit orangey. Looks good, it smells good. Let's say sherry cheers everybody. I have to say, it's another good beer from uh, West End Brewery. That tastes divine. But they've used, because um, it's a Commonwealth uh, Pale Ale, they've used malts from um, all different areas in the Commonwealth, so they've got some malts in there from UK, from New Zealand, from Australia. If I remember the story rightly, the only one they didn't get at the time was South Africa, but they found a South African one, so this might be redone with a South African malt in there as well. It's nice. It's inter It's an interesting. Um, on the aroma, I got more tropical. Flavour-wise, I seem to be picking up a little bit more citrus coming through. A little bit of pininess. A little bit of tropical in there as well. 
And I think that caramel's coming through as well, with just a little bit of um, sweet caramel, sweet toffee type flavours. But yeah, definitely citrus, definitely a little bit of tropical, definitely that sweet um, sweet toffee coming through as well, which is really nice. Almost like a little piney bitterness in there as well. It's a nice beer. So what about the ale? I was still stuck with... Um, no furniture in, so there might be a bit of an echo coming through and uh, temporary lights until I can get the electrician right, uh, around. So I'm hoping it's going to be sometime this week. Oh, finish, shame. I don't think I picked up any more of those when I was down there. Um, really nice. It's a fruity pale ale. It's got citrus, it's got that tropical, it's got a nice uh, bittersweet finish to it, really, really tasty. It's 4.2%, it's got a feel of something a little bit bigger than that, just a, just a little bit, but it's got a feel of something a little bit bigger than that. It's really good, another good one, um, score-wise, I'm going to score it 7.5 out of 10. 7 out of 10 for managed beers while you're drinking. Please enjoy it. Thank you for watching. Really appreciate it. Comment, like, subscribe, all the usual stuff. But until the next review, cheers everybody.